you know, all of us have seen each other on webcam for so long. And, to, well, yesterday, mm -hmm. no, two days ago, mm -hmm. and the time's gone by so quick. It's the first day I got to meet Lisa in person. In person. So it's so great for all of us to be here in person. So, Miss no, and, yeah, there we're centering ourselves a little better. Hi, everybody. And she's oh, just friend. as lovely in person as she is in. <laughs> Hi, um, Bev and Candace, Romper, Bumper, Stomper, Boo. Everybody I know is so in the room. So you're here to share with us tap news, paper. News, news. news. Here, can we close that? Because uh -huh. it confuses me. Does it? Okay. <laughs> so, hi, oh, hi, D. Oh, gosh, everybody's here. Hi, Janet. So, listen, you guys. You guys have heard me here talk about tap until I'm blue in the face, right? You all, you know about tap. You know about transfer artist paper. So, we submitted it at the show at CHA for the Innovations Awards. We got picked for the top 20. I think I told some of you that. Mm -hmm. Yes, Cynthia heard. Not only did we get picked for the top 20, we just found out yesterday that we are best of show. We got first. So, Cap Transfer Artist Paper got the best, most innovative product in the whole show, as judged by a group of celebrity judges that included Terry O and Deborah Norville and I don't, every, a bunch of other people that I have yet to figure out. So we're really excited and we're so happy that you guys love the product. And you guys have seen me demo it, so I'm not going to bore you, but I did want to show you a couple of really funny samples that we have that I don't think I've shown you before. So what was really fun about TAP that we that people got really excited about was some of the really unusual uses. We all know how to put it onto fabric. I've shown you guys a, a million times. And we know how fun it is to create fabric scrapbooks. But here's a sample of it on ribbon, where you can actually print out your words on the TAP. Transfer artist paper for a few of you in the room who might be living under a rock or who don't know me. <laughs> because it's like a broken record with me when I like a product. And so this is a really great way to create custom ribbon by just using your transfer paper to create words from your inkjet printer and then transfer them onto the ribbon. And then look at this. This photograph right here, this is a piece of Kleenex, people. Kleenex. Oh, I had paper. a hard time believing that was Kleenex. Well, Linda just about blew her nose on it. By the <laughs> state. So, you know, she's a lovely person. I love Linda. I'm so happy to meet her. No, just kidding. <laughs> But this is Kleenex, and look how gorgeous that picture is. is. Gorgeous. I mean, how fun. And then this was another one that I don't think I've shown you. This, this is, is my favorite because yeah. it's metal. Yeah, the, what it, it's like a This it's is a, a copper mesh. You know, it actually looks like Emiko Artemis, but um, it's a copper mesh. And I can see down here at the bottom that they have burnt it, so mm. it changes yeah. colors. It's just beautiful. And yeah. I am amazed that this actually transfers to metal. Yeah, every time. Uh, well, this is all, all these samples are from Leslie Riley, who helped us develop the product. And she just comes up with any kind of substrate and she'll put something on it and this one I don't think I've shown you this is organza Ooh, we might have to get it a, fuzzed a paper something behind, behind it, it. okay well, this is organza it's really really clear and really fun and sheer and the last thing I wanted to show you that I don't think I've shown you before is the twofer the twofer technique this is that ultra light Lutrador and I know Lutrador is another broken record product with me that I love so much but this is that really tissue thin Lutrador on top of a piece of cotton and what we did was we took the picture and transferred the picture at one time through both pieces of fabric. So you get this twofer of the transfer going through the luchador down to the bottom. Let's show everyone. What but it do. looks so dimensional. It looks really, really fuzzy and dreamy and dimensional when you have the two together. This looks like you would spend hours getting that effect in Photoshop. Exactly. Totally. Yeah. Seriously. It's really crackled, distressed effect Beautiful. because it goes through the fibers of the luchador. So doing a sheer fabric on top of a opaque fabric at the same time one transfer one step and you get this really lovely dimensional effect so I just want to show you a couple of other samples you guys have seen most of everything else that we've done with TAP it's really exciting and we're so so proud of everyone at CNT who has helped get this product off the door and so happy that you guys like it and I'm so thrilled that um, you know that you guys and are we're so excited that us. you won the CHA Innovations Award oh, and we? just for our viewers that is one of the highest awards you can win here at CHA so yeah. that is quite an honor yeah so we're, we're really really proud thank you so much